In our top story tonight, Acting Commissioner of Prisons, Deo Prasad Ramuta, says it's too early in the investigations to comment on the cause of death of the accused who was remanded into custody for the attempted murder on the lives of the Acting Deputy Commissioner of Prisons, Sherwin Bruce, and his daughter. The Commissioner says that he has seen reports stating that Emmanuel Joseph's death was due to cardiac arrest, but he cannot say at this point in time whether the report was confirmed by medical practitioners or not. However, Commissioner Ramuta says police are looking into the matter. So there's no um, issue to me as a reporter, to me, of any foul play or anything like that. But it's, 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 that is only as much I can say until I get more information. According to the Trinidad and Tobago Prison Service, on Friday, October 20th, at around 10.20 p.m., remanded inmate Emmanuel Joseph, who was housed at the Eastern Correctional Rehabilitation Center, was taken to the Arima Health Facility after complaining about chest pains. He was attended to and subsequently pronounced dead by the attending physician. Earlier this week, Joseph, who hails from Santa Cruz area, was remanded into custody. According to police, Joseph was one of two masked men who shot at a vehicle while it was parked outside the home of the acting deputy commissioner of prisons on October 11th. 